It has finally arrived. What is it? The opening of conference play tonight in Oxford. Number eight Ole Miss, 17 and one on the year. Welcomes the Tennessee Volunteers to Swayze Field. Ole Miss and Auburn, two of four teams in the entire country with only one loss in their record. You see the reigning national champion, Florida Gators, best record in the East. They are 16 and three. Goes right at him, got him with a fastball, swing and a miss. A walk in the top of the first, but a couple of strikeouts as well. Scoreless as we go to the bottom of the first on opening night of league play. Chopper left side, that'll score a run. Nick Fortes does his job, picks up his 17th RBI of the year, and Ole Miss takes a 1-0 lead. And goes there, and this ball is hit into the gap in right center. Diller trying to come all the way around to score. Golson will go into second with a stand-up double. Back-to-back -back two out hits, and Ole Miss leads 2-0 over the balls. Olenek wasn't able to squeeze it in right field. This ball lifted to left. Ball carrying to left field. Thomas Dillard gets to the wall, can't make the catch. And that'll be extra bases. Ammons trying to turn it into a triple. Dillard just now getting there. An RBI triple for Justin Ammons into the left field corner. Trying to put it in play and get a run home. Off the glove of Cooper Johnson. Ammons going to try to score, and he slides across safely. We're tied at two. High fly ball to left center field. Will Golson, the center fielder, you see fighting the win. That ball carried all the way to the warning track in deep left center, and Golson had to dive for it at the end. And he rocketed one to right field. Runner goes, ground ball up the middle, fielded by Kessinger. Tennessee strands a runner. Tomorrow is St. Patrick's Day. Now ball to short, and it goes through the legs of Lipsius. Oh, goodness. Error on the shortstop. Ole Miss has the leadoff man on base. In the NCAA tournament. Throw over, had him leaning. That is a pickoff. And Ryan Rollison got Lipsius by a bunch over at first base. And when you do that as a pitcher, you're effective. That ball's hammered down into the left field corner. That should be extra bases for Tim Elko. Daniels digs it out, leadoff double. Bunt here to try and get Elko into scoring position. He bunts at third base side. And it's a beauty. And Crochet falls down and everybody's safe. There's a pickoff play. And that ball went to the wrong. The 0-2 from Rollison. Anderson chops it. Rollison fields it, has to hurry, and throws Ammons out. First time that he's been retired at the plate. The 2-1. Line to left field. It's a base hit, and Tennessee will take the lead. Charleston comes home to score. Durke comes around to score. It's 4-2. 1-1 pitch. This one's rifled into right field. Elko hits the bag at third. He's going to come around to score. This time he'll do it without a throw, and it's now 8-3. Kessinger lines it to left. That's a base hit. First and second for Ole Miss with two down, and Ryan Olenek now coming to the plate. The one-two. Olenek gets a fly ball to left, on the run. Daniels on the run to the wall. It's a three-run home run for Ryan Olenek. And it's now a two-run ball game. First home run of the year for Olenek. Swing and a miss, 93 mile an hour fastball from Caracy. Tennessee strands a couple. The 0-2, chased one out of the zone. Not very good at bat there for Leftridge. Tennessee goes one, two, three in the ninth. Will Stokes does his job. Ole Miss looking for some ninth inning magic. The 1-1. Chopper to third, big hop for Staff, throws over, and Tennessee takes game number one of this three-game series on the opening night of league play.